Take a look at these. In most of today's paint or design programs, every color lives inside one of these, a perfectly plain square. But here's the problem. These pixel-perfect squares are based on a lie, a lie that we've all just grown accustomed to. This does not represent an accurate map of color to the human eye. In fact, the true map of all colors your screen can produce looks kind of weird. Try this. Open your color picker and slowly slide through your hues. Instead of a smooth rainbow, you'll notice magenta, blue, green, and red jump out very strongly, while cyan and yellow look a bit weak. That's not your eyes playing tricks on you. Your monitor really can push those four colors harder. Our supposedly perfect square has a few debts. Instead of plotting color within a tightly constrained box, let's plot it the way we actually see color. We'll start with neutral gray in the middle, then we'll expand outward, charting even changes in color in all directions. This plane represents all standard monitor colors at this lightness level. Now let's plot the entire color space in three dimensions. We begin with pure black at the bottom and work our way up to pure white at the top. This is the true shape of colors your monitor produces. Not very uniform, is it? Our once perfect RGB cube resolves into an irregular diamondish blob, fatter where the screen is powerful, at the extremes of pure red, green, blue, and magenta, and thinner where it's weak, yellow and cyan. This color space is called OKLCH, and because its coordinates are scaled to human perception, numeric tweaks finally map cleanly to what you feel on the screen. Ever try to make a palette with even transitions, like you'd get at a paint shop? Or try to create a clean and vibrant gradient between two hues without the muddy middle? We struggle to construct color palettes because we're building on an irregular foundation, where every chosen color is actually a very imprecise compromise. Only if we map color according to human vision can we build rich, harmonic palettes. Here are the advantages. With OKLCH, OK we can achieve buttery smooth and vibrant gradients without a washed out muddy middle. Designers can create perfectly uniform color palettes with even transitions, no more guess and check. And it's future-proof. OKLCH OK spans the entire visible gamut so even as modern monitors expand their gamut, they can never outgrow it. So the next time a color picker shows you a perfect cube or circle, remember, it's lying. The true shape of the colors your monitor produces is a weird, beautiful blob. And embracing that blob gives us truer, richer color combinations for all our digital designs. <laughs>